One person is in jail today, and police are searching for a 16-year-old suspect following a shooting at an elementary school early this year in Lawrence. Fox 59 Jesse Wells explains what led to the violence and how you can help the investigation. According to court records, the shooting outside Harrison Hill Elementary started with a fight between a group of teens. This week, police did arrest one woman for assisting a criminal in the case, but the accused shooter remains wanted on a warrant more than two months after the violence. In early March, Lawrence police were called to this elementary school and found a high school student shot in the lower leg. That victim survived and told police he'd been shot during a fist fight outside the school. According to this affidavit, 16-year-old San Juan Forte is accused of the shooting and faces charges in adult court of battery with a deadly weapon. Court records claim Forte was seen on video getting into a car driven by 21-year-old Vanessa O'Brien and fleeing the scene. Police found that getaway car a short time later, and although Forte was no longer in the car, police did find this distinctive red hoodie, which witnesses say was worn by the suspected shooter. Prosec <laughs> Yo, 98% 90, of school shooters are black. Yeah, I said it. And can't nobody argue with me unless you, you if you want to argue, if you a YouTuber and you want to argue that, you got to go do at least a thousand shows. You got to do at least a thousand live streams like this before you, before I even entertain you. I ain't even entertaining niggas to argue unless they do a thousand shows like this. 98% of school shooters are black. Press one. I ain't even arguing with you. Go do a thousand shows where you cover this shit for three, four hours a night, five hours a night, and then come back and I'll have you on and you can fucking argue with me about it. Salute to Text 47. He said, probably the last contribution I can make this month. Here you go, Ock. Thanks for what you do. Yeah, man. Other people got to step up, man. Salute to you, Tex47. We got, we got 300 watching right now. No, we got 350 watching right now. Salute to you, Tex47. We need one more contributor. One more to unlock the link. One more contributor to unlock the link. Unlock it. Unlock the link. a battery with a deadly weapon. Court records claim Forte was seen on video getting into a car driven by 21-year-old Vanessa O'Brien and fleeing the scene. Police found that getaway car a short time later, and although Forte was no longer in the car, police did find this distinctive red hoodie, which witnesses say was worn by the suspected shooter. Prosecutors also claim Forte was seen on social media wearing that same shirt and posing with a gun before the shooting. We want the public to be as safe as possible and not to be a victim of this foolish behavior. Because a warrant has been active against Forte since March, Lawrence police are asking for the public's help to track down the accused gunman. So we have this young man that's been out on the run for a couple months now. We just want to do whatever we can um, to get him into custody so he has, so he has his day in court. O'Brien, who is charged with assisting a criminal, was first arrested last week. But after being released from jail on a $500 bond, she failed to show up to court. That resulted in a new warrant being issued and O'Brien being arrested a second time on Monday. Finally, O'Brien is being temporarily held without bond at the Marion County Jail. Anyone with information on Forte's whereabouts is still asked to contact either Lawrence Police or Crime Stoppers. Jesse Wells, Fox 59 News. Jesse, thank you.